How much does a limbs cost? Introduction. Any organization that is thinking about putting a limbs in a lab or replacing an old limbs needs to understand the full limbs project cost, not just the cost provided in the quote from the limbs vendor. In this video, we will explore several of the sources of cost that added up will constitute your full limbs project cost. We will also go over some key definitions and points that will help ensure that when you are comparing costs between limbs, that you are doing so on an even playing field. Limbs licensing. Comparing limbs license costs can be complicated because there are several different types of limbs architectures and licenses available. Limbs architectures available include client server, web based, platform as a service, and software as a service. Different architectures can support different types of licenses. LIMS user license types include free or freemium, concurrent or simultaneous, named, casual, and submitter. Different LIMS licenses allow for different numbers of users per license, different levels of access to functionality, and different lengths of license life or validity. Some LIMS also offer specialty add-on modules for additional license fees. Some examples of these include instrument calibration and maintenance, electronic lab notebook, stability, and inventory. Other licenses that may be needed include database licenses, if they are not bundled with the LIMS, instrument licenses, if the LIMS requires interface instruments to have a LIMS license, and designer or developer licenses for your LIMS developers. The cost of LIMS user licenses range from $500 to $250 per user per month for SaaS licenses to $2,000 to $10,000 per user for a perpetual license. It is critical that you consider all the different licenses you may need when seeking to establish your full LIMS project cost, not just the user licensing. Also, when comparing LIMS costs, care must be taken to ensure that you understand what type of license, named or concurrent, and the lifetime of the licenses, monthly, yearly, or perpetual, that has been quoted by the vendor. Be sure to compare apples to apples. LIMS support. LIMS vendors offer a variety of support options and levels from no commitment hourly phone support to yearly support contracts. Yearly support contracts are offered in multiple levels. It is important to get a clear understanding of what is included in the level of support contract you are reviewing. Does it include updates, upgrades, phone support, remote support, on-site support? What is the guaranteed issue response and resolution time? The cost of a yearly LIM support contract can be 10 to 20% of the LIM software license cost. Hourly phone support rates vary widely, but average about $200 an hour. Hardware. There are several kinds of hardware that you will need to address when analyzing your LIM's costs, including servers, network devices, personal computers, mobile devices, printers, and other peripheral devices. But before going off and purchasing a new hardware to support your limbs, you must determine what you really need. Ask yourself these questions. What IT standards do we need to adhere to, if any? Can we leverage what we have? What needs to be purchased and by when? Of course, if you elected to go with a SaaS limbs, you will not need to purchase any new servers as the application and database will be hosted by the SaaS provider in the cloud. Implementation. The cost of your LIMS implementation will depend on many factors. Typically, implementation costs quoted in vendor proposals are estimates only. Most vendors require a paid engagement to accurately estimate their costs for system implementation. Besides the typical size and scope issues that affect costs, other factors to consider include the type of LIMS you are implementing, the LIMS implementation approach and methodology you employ, and your willingness to adapt your lab processes to fit out-of-box functionality. Personnel. Interestingly, the cost of personnel for a LIMS project is often underestimated or incorrectly derived. Resources can be secured from a number of sources, including internally, from the LIMS vendor, and from third-party consultants and subject matter experts. LIMS team members will need to be 100% dedicated to the LIMS project, so be sure to include the cost of backfilling the internal LIMS team members' positions for the duration of the project. Also, don't forget to account for other specialty roles that will be needed for a successful LIMS project, such as a project manager. The LIMS vendor's supply project manager only manages the configuration of the product and their resources. Change management leaders, LIMS trainers, 
database and network administrators, and the LIMS administrator. Instrument and systems integration. The cost of integrating your instruments and systems to your LIMS can also vary widely. Some LIMS vendors offer standardized interfaces for integrating their LIMS to some of the most utilized lab instruments and systems like chromatography data systems, next generation sequencers, and SAP. The cost of these interfaces also vary widely, as do the capabilities and functionality. Customized interfaces can also be developed, the cost of which will be very dependent on the complexity and type of interface. Simple one-way interfaces are less costly to develop than complex programmatic two-way interfaces. Data migration. Often overlooked when compiling the total cost of a LIMS project is the cost associated with migrating your legacy data to the new LIMS. The old data to be migrated can include both static data and dynamic data. The cost of data migration will be dependent on a number of factors. How much data is to be migrated? How clean is the data? How much data can be migrated programmatically? And how much data will have to be migrated manually? In summary, Understanding the total cost of your LIMS is extremely important for project budgeting and justification, as well as for attaining LIMS project success. We have exposed and discussed several of the factors that will contribute to your full LIMS project cost. We hope this information will save you from the unpleasantness of having to go back to the well to cover unforeseen LIMS project expenses. For more information to ensure you are comparing apples to apples between LIMS, click below to view our webinar.